The invitation to one year to go Invictus game in Canada startled Meghan up like a foam in the mouth. A formal invitation extended to Meghan Markle that the celebration of the Invictus game in Canada is cancelled as a result of a shocking turn of events. It was announced that the Duchess of Sussex would not be attending the Invictus game celebration in Canada. This decision was made without prior notice. Speculation is swirling about the motives behind this extraordinary move, and the world is impatiently awaiting an explanation. The news has sent shock waves through the media, and speculation is swirling everywhere. Join us as we delve into the specifics, unearth the controversy, and analyze the consequences of this dramatic shift, but before we continue, let's take a moment to discuss the incident which has pushed the nexus of sports, politics and activism back into the forefront. For more information, kindly subscribe to the channel and activate the notification bell. The Invictus Games are a representation of collective strength and perseverance. Many people have a particular place in their hearts for the Invictus Games, which are an international adaptive multi-sport event that was developed by Prince Harry. The Games were launched in 2014 with the intention of honoring and supporting wounded, injured, and sick members of the military service as well as veterans. Over the years, the event has achieved a lot of success. The participants who took part in the competition received worldwide recognition and acclaim that celebrated their bravery, strength, and determination. Meghan Markle's participation in the event catalyses for change in the world. She has been a vocal supporter for a variety of social problems, and her work with the Invictus Games has been a key element of her humanitarian endeavors. Also, as the Duchess of Sussex, she has been a campaigner for women's rights. Meghan Markle is a former actress who is now married to Prince Harry. Using her platform to raise awareness and create good change in the areas of racial equality and mental health awareness. A surprising change of behavior, the decision to reissue the invitation. Despite the fact that the precise reasons for the decision to resend Meghan Markle's invitation to the one year to go Invictus Games celebration have not been released. The decision has caused a great deal of confusion and debate among many people. As a result of the Duchess's recent provocative words and public appearances which have garnered criticism from certain sectors, others assert that it could be the outcome of these events. Furthermore, there are many who believe that political pressure or worries about the event being overtaken by media attention may have been factors in the decision-making process. There is a complex nexus between sports, politics, and activism. Throughout the course of history, this episode causes a wider range of questions to arise regarding the junction between sports, politics, and activism. Actresses, such as Meghan Markle, have utilized their influence to bring attention to timely concerns and to challenge the existing quo. However, this has not always been met with widespread support. Sports have frequently served as a platform for social and political remarks. There have been intense debates caused by the controversy surrounding players' activism. These debates have ranged from the significance of the right to freedom of expression to the possibility of sports becoming a distraction from political issues. When it comes to being a public figure walking the fine line between activism and representation, despite the fact that her activism has garnered extensive support, Meghan Markle's involvement in social causes has also been met with criticism and reaction. Here are some of the hurdles that she has experienced. Although there are those who believe that her outspokenness compromises her position as a member of the royal family, others disagree. This episode serves as a reminder of the delicate balance that exists between activism and representation, particularly for those who are in positions of privilege and influence. While some people believe that her platform presents an opportunity to bring about change and promote awareness, that is not the case. The responses and repercussions experienced by the fallout. A multitude of responses have been received from a variety of sources in response to the invitation that was withdrawn. Meghan Markle's supporters believe that this is an intentional attempt to stifle her voice and limit the amount of activity she would engage in. The episode has sparked debates about the role of the royal family, the bounds of free speech, and the responsibilities of public characters and influential persons in shaping public opinion. On the other hand, detractors claim that her remarks and actions have been divisive and needless.
During the time that the world is waiting for further clarification, the fact that Meghan Markle was not invited to attend the celebration of the one-year anniversary of the Invictus Games has caused waves of controversy and debate. There is a complex link between sports, politics and activism, and this episode serves as a reminder that even the most recognized personalities must walk a fine line when utilizing their platform to effect change. This occurrence invites us to reflect on this relationship. This episode will likely have a significant impact on future conversations and shed light on the complex dynamics that exist between the activism of public personalities and the consequences that they are subjected to.